Ladies and gentlemen, WWE Velocity and Wyatt's World present Bad Blood 2023. Tonight's opening match will be LA Knight facing an opponent of my choosing. Then we will move on to the Tag Team Championships where the Street Profits will be defending their titles against the Viking Raiders. Dolph Ziggler will be defending his European Championship against the High Flying Ricochet. Then we've got some breaking news for you. The Women's Championship Triple Threat match between Asuka, Rhea, and Liv Morgan is now Extreme Rules. Can Asuka overcome the odds and retain? We've also got Edge and Cody Rhodes settling this beef in a last man standing match. And the main event is AJ Styles challenging Bobby Lashley for the World Heavyweight Championship. Get some popcorn and get comfy because it is time for some bad blood. Anyway, what is going on guys? Welcome back to another video and welcome to Bad Blood 2023. This is me playing the first pay-per-view from our universe mode and I do want to let you guys know that I plan to have this all in one video but it might take me a couple days so if you see me change outfits and stuff, well that's why. So without further ado, sit back, relax, and let's get into our first premium live event. Well, here we go, Mike. If it isn't L.A. Knight, the man who scratched and clawed and pissed and moaned to his way on this card. He may have beat Kevin Owens, but he didn't beat my criticism. You gotta wonder who Wyatt picked out for him to face, though. Apparently, it's somebody who's on the roster. A lot of people thought it was gonna be Stone Cold Steve Austin or a legend. I've been told otherwise. Oh, good heavens! It's Shinsuke Nakamura! Holy shit! What a sight for the ages! We never thought we'd see this man again! I'll tell you what, LA Knight sure has his hands full because the King of Strong Style is back! And we are off Shinsuke Nakamura with the takedown! You think you're worthy of this position? Uh oh, Shinsuke against the ropes! What are we thinking? Ooh! And he is now taunting the crowd! They love this man! LA Knight sidewalk slam! We are at an eight count! Consciously, LA Knight runs back into the ring and resets the count. What a genius! LA Knight again dodges it into a big boot! And a knee to the head! This is an all out brawl! Oh! Oh! And back into the ring we go! LA Knight nearly at a full health bar still! And a reversal! Shinsuke, what are we thinking? Oh! And he's signaling for it! Gain Sasha! In your fucking dreams, he is not getting pinned. Ooh! Oh, and a huge boot! I am bleeding! Uh-oh. Oh! That hurt my back, Jesus Christ! LA Knight reversing it, Nakamura! <laughs> that was actually dope! Oh, a huge overcastle! Get in the ring! And it is near! Good night! One, two, no! And a kick out, are you kidding? <laughs> and now, can he finally put away his demon? Gain Sasha for a third time! And a rope break, holy shit! There's no shot, he just reversed my signature. No! Oh. No! LA Knight connects! No! LA Knight defeats Shinsuke Nakamura! The return has been spoiled! Holy hell! He's him! Honestly, I'm okay with that because I don't think anybody saw that coming. LA Knight is for real. He's getting a push. Wow, what a shocker. Seriously, like, I tried to play. I tried to win as Shinsuke there. I just got beat. Anyway, we are now on to the tag team match. The Street Profits versus the Viking Raiders. Who do you guys got? Talk about charisma, Mike. These are two of the best in the business today. They've got everything. Swag, gold, Bianca Belair. Dude, a lot of people hate this team. I don't get it, man. They could be really, really cool if you just give them a chance. 
And this is what it's all about, the Tag Team Championships. All right, it looks like we have Ivar and Dokken starting things off, and Ivar hits him with a massive crossbody. I mean, that is 350 pounds coming at you at Mach 12 speed. It's impressive. Boom! Anyway, Dawkins, Irish whipping me into the corner, followed up by a splash. Uh-oh. Irish whip. Be ready. Oh! It looks like Montez and Eric are fighting on the outside, too. This is an all-out war between these two teams. Uh-oh. Oh! Ivar looks like he's going to tag in his partner, Eric. Eric and Ivar would be very smart to not let Montez Ford in this match. Oh! And they're clearly not smart. Oh, and a huge clothesline! Oof! Eric now taunting, showing off how strong he is. Valhalla! Oh, and a huge clothesline from Montez making a comeback. No! DDT! Montez putting him into the corner. Clothesline! Eric finally getting over to Ivar. And back to where we started in another big clothesline. Come on. Spinebuster! That was actually dope. Boom! Into the corner. Missing! Ivar lays him out! DDT! All right, let's get a look at whatever this is. Is that his signature? Wait, that was actually sick. That was like a roundhouse kick. Anyway. Reverses the finishing move. You have to be kidding. That was it. That was the opening. Bam! Lays him out again! Here we go! Roundhouse! One! Apparently, I haven't played a tag team match on this game yet. All right. Anyway, Ford breaks it up instantly. Eric throws him out of the ring. Angelo! Damn it! Again, when I have an opportunity to end it, he's just all over me. Ivar reverses it! Throws him! There's still time! What is it gonna be? Okay, it's taking you 10 years to hit that, and now you're not gonna get the pin off in time because of that. I'm literally pissed off right now because of how long that finishing move takes. Irish whipping Ivar into the ropes! Bam! And Angelo Dawkins! Oh my god! Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh! Eric! 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 And we are off! It's like we're gonna get some sort of suplex, probably the one that takes six hours to actually happen, yep. I mean, I could go make a fucking sandwich right now. Oh, and a massive lariat! Here we go! Backdrop! Uh-oh. Be careful! No! You gotta come help me, brother. And Dawkins coming back in. And Eric hits him back, fighting for his life. And he hits Ford out of the ring. My voice just cracked and I don't care. Bam! One, two, no! And Dawkins already back into it. It is time. And he reverses your finishing move. Holy hell. Oh! Ivar. Oh no, I need my partner, bro. Get up! No! What? What is he doing? What is he doing? <laughs> this is so overkill. Oh my, look at my meter. Where is Ivar? What the hell? And the Street Profits retain. That was anarchy, man. After all that, I thought we had him. Hey, that match got five stars. It was elite. All right, guys, so it is now time for the European Championship match between Dolph Ziggler and Ricochet. I do want to say that I'm recording this a day after the last two matches, so if my tempo seems a little bit off, that's why, but I'll try and be up to par. Yo, I don't know how it's possible for someone to constantly have a dead controller like I do. Anyway, now making his way to the ring, we have our challenger for the European Championship, Ricochet. Picture Rey Mysterio without a mask, because that is who this man is. Now we are watching the champion make his way to the ring, a seasoned vet of WWE, in many's opinion, one of the greatest of all time, Dolph Ziggler. Now I understand, Mike, this guy may not have the accolades to be the GOAT, but his performance would say otherwise, he's elite. I am playing as Dolph, by the way. I'm gonna try and get him to retain this belt, but I am 0-2 on this pay-per-view so far, so I'm not guaranteeing anything. Ah, uh, yes. And there's the prize. I do want to say eventually I plan to replace the European title with something else, but for now it's just, it's gotta stay. However, we are now under our way and Dolph Ziggler drop kick Ricochet right between the eyes. Now what are we thinking? In the corner right away, Ziggler grinding his head on the rope. What a sick bastard. Oh, Ricochet rolling out of harm's way. Oh, what the hell? 
Submission hold already. Get me out of that. Okay, Ricochet now picking Ziggler up. Wow! Bam! Now Ricochet going to the top rope. Doesn't decide to jump after Ziggler and clotheslines him instead. What was that? And we've got a people's elbow? Oh! And the knees come up. That's why he's the greatest of all time. Followed by a drop kick. Ricochet reversing. Hitting a backflip. Hitting another backflip. Hitting a third backflip. What the fuck is this guy doing? Oh my god! Okay, Ziggler. I'm, I don't know what to do. Dude! We're gonna get squashed! Is my controller, like, turned off or something? What is going on? <clears throat> and I get drop kicked right away. I mean, Ricochet is essentially Roman Reigns right now. I can't hit anything. I don't know how I'm kicking out of this. Famous sir! Try and show some damn fight here, Dolph. It's a little bit late. I mean, this guy seriously is too fucking good. What is this? Sleeper hold? I thought his signature was a super kick. And he's gonna reverse that instantly. Pele kick! And I'm gonna get killed here, dude. Holy f- Oh! Super kick! Come on! Super kick! Come on! Throw, oh my god, and he reverses it! What?! Drop kick, and he reverses it again! What kind of stupid shit is this?! I got that, I literally hit it. All right, I'm 0-3, I literally can't win. Congrats, Ricochet, I just don't understand how you can reverse a third super kick after taking two in the face. All right, now we will have the Women's Championship Triple Threat Match. Asuka defending her belt against Rhea Ripley and Liv Morgan. This one I'm gonna try and give to my lady, Rhea. Now, one of the most popular competitors in the women's division. Okay, so I will be honest with Liv, uh, she has gotten a ton better over the last year, and I mean a ton. But I still don't see her as world championship material, and I'm sorry, I'm, j I'm just an honest man. And now Mommy, on the other hand, that's a little bit of a different story. Her, the Empress. <laughs> Nobody makes an entry. Fall in love, I don't know the words to her song at all. Oh, really? They don't even have a damn belt for it? It's just that? I forgot, this is an Extreme Rules match too, so in other words, good luck you guys. Oh my god! Oof! Oh! <laughs> Oof! Oof! Oh! Now what are we thinking? Oh! Asuka with a nice move and she's again hit with the boot! Into a clothesline! Rhea Ripley to Liv Morgan! Boom! Oh! Uh oh, Asuka going for a submission on Rhea! And mommy powers out! Oh! Another series of clotheslines by Rhea! Oof! Excuse me Liv, what was this? Asuka taunting on the outside, not sure why. Liv with a nice reversal, kicking Rhea in the gut. Liv, off the ropes. Bam! Code breaker! And Asuka breaks it up instantly. Uh-oh, what's Rhea Ripley thinking now? That was reversed. Are you... Oh, son of a bitch. Uh-oh, Asuka to Rhea. Bam! Into the ring! Uh-oh, what's Liv thinking to Asuka on the outside? Hurricanrana! Now we got Rhea and Liv with the double team on Asuka! Not sure how the Singapore cane got in the ring, I'm guessing it was from Asuka, but now it belongs to Mommy. Oh! Liv taking Asuka out of the equation and running right into a baseball bat sized swing! Ooh! Now Rhea to Asuka! Now Rhea to Liv! What's Rhea thinking? Throwing Asuka out of the ring! Liv Morgan with the bulldog from behind Rhea! Instant recovery! Super kicks Liv! This is the end! She's calling for the Riptide! Bam! One! Oh, and Asuka broke it up. Are you serious? And now she's gonna get a Riptide! Just like Roman Reigns at WrestleMania! Stack them bodies! What?! Liv with the kip up and she breaks it up. This is insane. Liv Morgan rolling to the outside. Rhea again flattens Asuka with the kick. This is it. Riptide has to end it. Bam! One, two, and she kicks out. What the hell? Okay, I'm actually getting a little bit annoyed right now. Like, I feel like this game is not letting me win matches anymore. What the fuck? Bam! 
And of course, I get socked in the head with the cane. There! Come on now, dude! Seriously! Oh, and well, uh, fuck. Now Asuka's back up, dude. Uh, can we hit 11 Riptides in one match? Nope, Asuka reverses that one too. What is Asuka doing with the ladder? Oof! Okay, this ends now. And Liv reverses it. Fourth Riptide of the match, and here comes Asuka. Are you serious? No way! Asuka lock. What the f Okay guys, I don't know what's going on anymore. You just saw it. I hit four or five of my finishing moves and I, I still can't win. I mean, I'm happy I'm given instant classics, but this is loss, 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 loss. I don't even know what to say. Other than we've got a last man standing match to play through with Edge and Cody Rhodes. This one I will be playing as Cody in, and this one I'm not losing. No way, no how, nope. Now I gotta be honest, ladies and gents, this is one of the most heated slash personal rivalries I think I have ever come across. Edge is a strong believer that Cody walked out on the company years ago that Edge helped build. Cody is a strong believer that he was mistreated and he needed to go and make a name for himself. And now that he's back to reclaim Edge's throne, a man who has never walked out on the WWE unless he was forced to retire, it just hasn't sat well. Edge also groped Brandy Rhodes in a Dairy Queen. The son of a dream, the American nightmare. Michael, a man who redefined himself away from WWE. Adrenaline in my soul. Something, something, Cody Rhodes. Wow! And we are underway. Cody Rhodes, Edge, last man standing. I'm gonna touch my wife's ass? Okay, maybe you can. Up, down. This time he's looking for a power bomb. Bam! And Cody with the reversal now, and the hit. Now he's got Edge into the ring, and Cody's going for a weapon. He's got a chair. Bam! Come on, come take your beating. Mm. Wow! Cody with the bulldog now. Weird pedigree pile driver thing. Mm. And there it goes, the Cody Cutter. No, I didn't think so. Get off of me. Here we go. Can Cody finally hit it? The Hurricanrana. Eight, and he's up again. Bam! And Edge with the drop toe hold. Hitting him another time. Uh-oh, Edge calling for the spear. And it connects. There we go. And Cody with a huge reversal onto Edge. Cody calling for it. I think this is the Canadian Destroyer. I could be wrong. Bam! Crossroads! Ah! Another one! Bam! One, five, nine, and he's gonna get up! No! Oh! Ooh! To the back of the head. Bam! Another one to the back of the head. Close line! This ends now. And I mean now. Come on. What the fuck? A bit of a glitch, but we hit our signature. And Edge reverses the fucking crossroads. And now he's going for a spear. Like, seriously, I don't know what to do. I couldn't even reverse it, man. I'm gonna fucking lose again. Get down. Fuck this. Crossroads! He gets back up. I'm beating the absolute lights out of him with this chair. Eight, and he's getting up. Here we go, Edge. Count it! And he's up at seven. And he reverses it. I can't reverse these! And we're up again. It is time! It's time! Why did that chair go through him? Dude! Oh my fucking goodness! And Cody with the takedown. And another crossroads. I'm not playing a last man standing match ever again. Nine? No, and he's getting back up. I, guys. And he rev- Oh! I mean, I, I'm just beating his life away. He's just not staying down. Oh, how did he hit me with that? I can't kick him! What is this game? This is seven, guys. I'm I'm not playing anymore. Don't fucking do it. Do not get up. And I'm up. Oh, this is so great. Yeah, awesome, 2K. Bam! Oh my heavens! This is it! 
I'm done. I'm seriously done. Edge gets the win. We're not playing that anymore. All right, guys, I want to apologize for not finishing that match, but I literally just had to go walk my dog. I was so upset. I seriously don't know what's going on. It's like universe mode is just unbeatable opponents. I don't want to put the difficulty down from legend, but if I can't win, then this isn't going to be fun for me to play. And I don't want to win every match, but dang, like, give me a chance at one of them. That was 26 minutes. That's like a Madden game. Anyway, it is now time for the main event. Our champion Bobby Lashley is defending the world title against AJ Styles. Uh, I'm going to try and retain with Bobby, but knowing my luck so far, we're going to lose. But let's try it anyway. <laughs> you said it, Michael. Now here, Mike, is a guy who really is one of the greatest of all time, AJ Styles. Lashley is ready for a fight. Now, sadly, AJ Styles' redemption arc has to do with him taking down the Almighty. Bobby's a man who has fought long and hard to earn that title, and he holds it with great pride. And there it is, the big gold. And we are underway. Lashley, Styles, they are going at it. Lashley, right away, picks him up for the military press. And bam! AJ, your hands are full here. You have not thought of the circumstances. AJ and Lashley on the outside. Lashley again throws him down. Uh-oh. Lashley throwing AJ into the corner. Looks like we're going up top. What is Bobby thinking? Another press. Bam! What is AJ gonna do? And he misses the clothesline into a suplex. And Bobby with the reversal. Huge clothesline and it somehow misses. This game is as buggy as they come. My goodness, 2K. Lashley somehow is the most agile person ever. AJ reverses that. Lashley reverses that, and Lashley, now he's gonna hit it, the Dominator! And AJ fucking reverses it. Guys, I don't know what to do. I might have to turn the difficulty down. This is unplayable. Suplex, are we gonna hit it? I can't tell. Everything we do gets reversed. <clears throat> now Lashley, and AJ reverses it. And Lashley reverses it. Where are we going with this match? Taste the pull. Going for the power bomb! Is he gonna win by count out in the main event? Oh sure, AJ Styles will stay down, but Edge will never. I dude, he literally slid into the ring and turned me around, and then it just is letting him do whatever he wants. Well, I don't I literally a rope break. There we go. The Herlock! Yes! Come on! I don't care if this is the end of the match, I gotta win once! <sighs> can't do it and AJ reverses it and he hits the Styles Clash I guarantee you I get pinned now but I, uh, roll break it's not letting me fucking play the game you guys again dude come on 2k yep 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 I'm trying to keep my composure with you guys the best I can but I am so angry at this game right now yeah oh here we go the phenomenal forearm I reversed it, man! Reversal! Get up! Bam! And the Herlock is in! AJ is done! Tap out! Well, I won, and it was the last match of the card, and it was probably the worst match of the show. Well, guys, that was all for Bad Blood. I'm sorry about the lackluster main event, but like I said, I was progressively getting more and more angry after every match, so I'm gonna have to change some settings for the next pay-per-view, but we're definitely not done with this. If you guys did like this video and you wanna see more, you already know what to do to show support. Comment, like, subscribe, turn that bell on. I do my best to post on this channel every single day. However, with everything I just said, I'm gonna hop off and get this edited so you guys can watch it on time. I hope you all have a fantastic rest of your week, and I will see you in the next video.